3.30 kick in Charlotte at Bank of America Stadium against North Carolina. Got a lot of respect for Coach Brown, obviously working for him for three years. You know, Carol and I were talking the other night, uh, probably the, the, three of the three of the better years we've had in coaching, you know, there, there at Texas. And glad he's back in college football. Not that he wasn't in college football, but he was on y'all's team. And now he's back on our team. So that's a, that's a good part of it. I'm just kidding. Y'all can laugh. I mean, a little bit there. Loosen up, you know. But uh, – He's uh, really hired a really good staff. You know, Phil Longo was at Ole Miss, and a guy I've got a lot of respect for. Jay Bateman did a fantastic job at, uh, at West Point. Stacey Searles and I won a national championship together at LSU. Uh, so a lot of guys I've got a lot of respect for. You know, first games, expect the unexpected. Uh, you know, you're trying to piece together film from different, you know, teams and different things. you got point of attack tapes from the North Carolina players that have been there before and played there previously. A lot of those guys we've recruited. So I think, you know, got some good football players on that team. This is a team that lost five games by one score or less. Uh, you know, in those situations, I lost a game to a hurricane. And obviously, you know, confidence is such a, an important part of what we do. And you lose a little confidence in those situations. Uh, and I think that's probably what happened in that situation. Snowballed on them a little bit last year. How much do you expect Phil Longo to do what he did against y'all at Ole Miss? And, and how much of it do you expect to be new? Well, again, I think people do what they do. And Phil's been a coordinator for a long time and been very successful at what he's done. Now, is there going to be some different things that he does because he's going to evaluate the talent he has at North Carolina as opposed to maybe what he had at Ole Miss as opposed to what he maybe had at Sam Houston? So you, you're going to adapt what you do to your players and what they can do best. And that's what good coaches do, and that's what Phil is. So, you know, there will be some changes. And I told our guys this morning, expect the unexpected. There's going to be something we're not prepared for. you got to fall back on your fundamentals, your technique, and your teammates. And that's the bottom line, and that's what we'll plan on doing. With the quarterback, how do you go about gathering information on him? Well, we recruited Sam. We think Sam's a fantastic player. We offered him here at South Carolina. Uh, he's got arm talent. Uh, he had – uh, all kind of records there uh, in, in high school. A guy that's got ability to run the ball. Uh, he's a competitor. He's a battler. Uh, he can make all the throws as far as the touch throws. He can zip it. So, I mean, he, we got a lot of respect for Sam. We offered him here at South Carolina.